Hey guys, it's Jay, and welcome to part 7 of Let's Play The Sims 2 Legacy Challenge. Now, last time I left off, we did a little bit of renovating in the house, but this time I'm in build mode, and they're both at work, so I thought it would be the perfect time to build their wedding ceremony. Now, they're go probably gonna, when I do the Legacy Challenge and stuff like that, they always like have it like at the back of the lot and stuff. And yeah, so that's where I'm going to build it. And one of you guys said to help reduce the lagging, I can turn shadows off, which I already have. Turn reflections off, I can survive without reflections. And turn neighborhood view off. Uh, so small, I guess. And neighbors off. Decorations off. I guess that would work. But if I just having trouble just like with, you know, like it just, the environment isn't very good, then I'll just turn it back on. But like, it's fairly okay with the view distance being small and the focus being on the lot. It's, it's kind of fine, but yeah, I kind of like it like that. But anything to make, help it stop lagging, right? Right. Okay. So now we're going to get to building our wedding ceremony. So we're going to go into party decor and we are going to maybe get one of these things okay so they come in three colors I like the rose one I guess that's very fitting and we will put that right there wait there turn it around so it's facing forwards oh because the arrows are telling you when it's facing forwards. Okay, so we've got that, which is the most important part of the wedding ceremony. Could we put like little decorate? We'll, we'll focus on we'll focus on the decorations that go around it after we put like chairs and stuff down. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to pick. Does this have like kind of a rosy sort of thing to it? I hope it does. No, it doesn't. Um, hmm. It would be really handy if there was like a folding chair that was like not, didn't have balloons. But I guess we can work with that. It's better than nothing. Okay, and then there's like that carpet of roses. It's not really a carpet, it's just like roses. I think this is it. Yeah, this is it. We'll get purple ones so we can have some variety. And we might put some more over here. Okay, so we've done that. And we might put a little bit of decorations, like flowers and stuff, around it. It would have to be in the gardening section of build mode. I remember like the goth family had like we'll do move objects on because we're allowed to do that cheat and isn't it like wait isn't it like only for glitches let me see um we may use I'm trying to look for that word of move objects. You may not. Hmm. Oh, just as for bugged objects. So I guess we can't really do that. That sucks, but we'll handle it. So move objects off. Okay, that will restrict where we can put this. Okay. I guess we can put like roses at the back. Those aren't roses. Um, flowers or whatever. Okay. We need to find good ones, like pinkish ones. I guess this can work. Wait, what about the other color? Yeah, that's fine. We can go with that. 
Yes. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Pretty darn good. And we might put a little bit of a pond. A man-made pond. This is very... T this is going to be temporary. I'm just saying. So this pond is not going to be here forever. But, you know... We get what we get, I guess, if that makes sense. Probably doesn't, but anyway. Yeah, see, the water looks a bit weirder with reflections off, but I don't really care. And we will put the flowers onto the pond. Yes, we will. No, not flower. They're not flowers. We can put... Yeah, you know what? We're going to put pond flowers on if that's what they're called. Water lilies, I guess. Yes, okay. So here's our little s mini wedding ceremony thing going on. Oh, we actually need to get like a table thing, don't we? For um, the cake and stuff. <coughs> yes, we do. We'll put it there. And get the cake, the wedding cake, this one, and we'll put it there. There we go, here's the wedding ceremony. I guess we can take like a picture, I guess, of like the cake there. Hey guys, so Noah has come home and he's been promoted to junior officer. You finally gained entrance to the officers club. No resting on your laurels though. You must keep your body in top physical condition if you want to advance. No one now works from 7 a.m. to 1 p.m. starting immediately. Noah brought home 661 simoleons today and got a bonus of 1,322 simoleons. Okay, that's pretty cool. And when when is she coming home? All right, 2 p.m. So not too far away when she's coming home but we will turn the roof off and get into the house we'll get him to make the bed and he's doing that little dance again okay and what was I going to say I don't know there's nothing else really okay if you hear the door in the background that's just someone coming in to get the laundry because like this is the same room where the laundry gets folded, I guess. Yeah. We're going to make him have a shower for the wedding. And get him to change into... Well, he'll change into his formal clothes when he gets to the arch. So we don't really need to get him to do that. Yeah. Every time I get my sims to have a wedding, I always, like, decorate it differently. It's just... I like decorating weddings and sims. It's just what I like to do. Okay. Okay. She should be coming home soon now. Jade should. And she's been promoted as well. Jade has been promoted to flight officer. Somebody has to drop those troops, deliver that cargo, and guard the airspace over SimCity. There's a pay grade advance here, but earning your wings will require additional training with a flight simulator program at the base. Mechanical skill is a must and body skill is not far behind. Jade now works from 9am to 3pm. Starting immediately, Jade got brought Jade brought home 770 simoleons today and got a bonus of 1,540 simoleons. And she also brought a friend home from work, which is perfect for her wedding because that's what she's going to do. She's going to throw a wedding party. Okay. Yep. Is she going to do the dance as well? No, she's not. Okay. I guess it, is, I, I, it might depend on their personality as well if they want to do the dance. Okay, guys. So we have the list of guests choosing and maximum two guests. Okay, that's nice. We'll get Latoya to come and... We'll get a guy. Gilbert Jackwit. Okay. Congratulations. The wedding's on and the guests are on their way. Let the festives begin. Okay. Oh, and it's cold outside. Oh. 
We should have. I don't know. Is it possible to like borrow, like not borrow, but go to a community lot for a wedding? Like just decorate the community lot to your um, preference. Preference. I don't know how to. I don't know how to pronounce that word. I don't know. Yes. Okay. So here are the guests. Here they come. And now it is time for Noah to get married. Yep. Noah's getting married. Gibson. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay guys, so they just got married and let's get Jade to cut the cake. Okay. Sorry, I'm taking a lot of photos of this because it's a memorable moment for them. It is. Very memorable moment. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's a roof raiser, the party is. We'll take as many photos as we can, I guess. Oh, that house in the background. Not what I was looking for. And that guy is coming over for the cake. What the heck? Okay, we're just being a photographer now. Oh, let's take a photo behind these. Oh, we can't really. But yeah. Everyone's having a good time. It's a roof raiser. Okay. Oh, and he already wants to have a baby. Wow, that's soon. <laughs> well, Sim's lives are very short, so I don't see why not. But yeah. They can have the same bedroom now as well, can't they? Yeah. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to organize their bedroom. Jade is still out there. Who is this? Is this Puck? Puck summer dream. I guess it's good to just have your wedding out in the open, in my opinion, because then other people can come if you don't have enough enough guests, and it just fills up the chairs. That's why when we don't, I don't have much family friends. My Sims don't have much family friends. I usually just like have it out in the open and do about four chairs because like not much people are going to come, of course. So yeah, I just realized we don't have a sink in that kitchen. Yes, we don't have a sink. And everyone is being in the way. Look at Noah on his new fancy schmancy bed. He enjoys it. Finally, the wedding party's over. But we got a roof raiser. Wedding. I guess because their lives are short, we could get them to have a little something, something to note. Um, woohoo. We'll get them to do that because since Sims' lives are short, we, we we better take the chance. And this is the legacy challenge. We have to have children. Like, why wouldn't we? I hope it's not too early and I hope I'm not rushing it. But yeah, they're married now. So there's nothing much we can do about it. I'm sorry, I almost crap burst into laughter because I can just never take Sims seriously. <laughs> Ever. Yeah, they just did that. 
Yeah. Um, I will see you guys in the morning when they wake up, and he has a rest day tomorrow, and she does too, because it's the weekend for them, so I'll see you guys then. So yeah, see you in the morning. Okay guys, so we're back, and I realised when they did woohoo, oh, I thought she was about to vomit, okay. When they did woohoo, they, the little bell chime did not go off, or at least I didn't hear it. So, we're going to try again when they take care of their needs, because they are very hungry, and they need to pee, or poop, or whatever they do. I've realised we need another, we're going to probably have to get another bathroom soon enough. Be quiet. Oh yes! Okay, so that little noise means that she's pregnant. 